And Janike a double-double against Southern Miss, 17 and 11. Yeah, he did a little bit of everything in that game. Blocked shots, drew charges, and uh, really scored a high efficiency. Three no good. Offensive rebound, though, by Nezikwesi. Averages seven and a half rebounds, number 23 in blue. He's got it now working on Echenique. This will be an interesting matchup. Haynes Jones tried to dig it out of there. Yeah, you want your guard dropping down, diving down there and trying to disrupt that. He should get one dribble on that second dribble. That guard open right down the middle of that zone. Really nice pass by Eric Stevenson there. And Chenique, the junior college transfer, five games in double figure scoring. A couple of double doubles, including the other day downtown against Southern Miss. There's a big match up there. Udeze <laughs> came in to try to turn away. Nezikwesi came, came in averaging 14 and a half. Emmanuel Nezikwesi, three-point range. McDuffie got hung up on a screen. Kind of ran into his own guy, Stevenson, there on the defensive end. Ricky Torres misfires on a three, and ORU's now scored five in a row. Shockers are getting some pretty open looks against that zone, but just knocking, not, not knocking anything down. Nezikwesi had it. Knocked away by Udeze. Trying to speed Oral Roberts up. Get him out of their comfort zone a little bit. Shockers have tied it at 13 all. Aiden Saunders into the game now. He's the one that fires an air ball with the offensive rebound and put back by Emmanuel Nezikwesi. 8.4 a game for Kalen Malone. He's doing a good job. He worked hard for Greg Marshall and the Shockers up here. Well, now Echenique has two to join Marcus McDuffie with two. Yeah, when you're fighting over a screen, when, you're, when your man is cutting over a screen, it, it's, it's such a temptation to grab him and to put your hands on him, and the referees are really looking for that. you got to show your hands. you got to move your feet and not put your hands on that offensive guy as he comes off a screen. Nesequese hits the free throw. Emmanuel Nesequese now has five points. He's a 70% foul shooter. ORU's first free throw. That's a big ball game. Had 17 points against Missouri, uh, 18 against Southern Myth, Southern Methodist University. So he's only got three points on one three pointer. 12 0 Shocker run is giving Wichita State a little breathing room here in the first half. Nezikwese trying to work on poor Bear Chandler. And boy, that's the oh, shot you man. want him taking. I'll tell you what, I thought... Paul Mills at ORU trying to implement O'Banner, Jurgens, Weaver, Francis Lotsis. Wow. All of those guys are freshmen. Now, Lotsis got two really early fouls, so he hasn't been a uh, cuff the deficit. Down a little closer. That's a quasi can really score. Oh, he's starting to heat up. Seven and six, a final four run, 35 straight wins in 2014. Uh, just a tremendous run by Greg Marshall and the Shockers since 2010 on. Neza Quasi hits a rare three for him. Doing here. That three wouldn't go by. An Extended minutes here tonight against Oral Roberts. He gives the Shockers their biggest lead. And poor Bear Chandler. He's just three out of six from the line before that trip. And the Shockers are 15 of 18 from the line here tonight. Wow. Ooh, tough shot. Nezikwesi. Nezikwesi. Get your switch or do something on that ball screen. Marcus McDuffie's been on the bench a while, but Wichita State's had the score going the right direction even without him. Brown explodes to the basket, but may have had it partially blocked. 